clearly when you read from the websites of this CDN, they are stating that they are for dialogue. Dialogue. I mean, that is stand for dialogue and nothing but dialogue. These people clearly state clearly dialogue. CD. The Coalition for Dialogue and Negotiation. Now, let me give you the two differences between dialogue and negotiation. Dialogue means that. Dialogue means that you recognize it as a state problem, not an interstate problem. Mediation is always when you have two parties at conflict and you want to mediate between them. Dialogue means it's a domestic problem. Dialogue in every clear word of international or domestic politics, it is a domestic problem and you solve it with dialogue. Mediation is an international word applied to diplomacy between two or more states. When a body like the Coalition for Dialogue clearly stating that it's a coalition for dialogue, meaning they recognize this problem as an inter- And that is why on the website, they are clearly stating that they want to end, they want to end the war in Cameroon. Ambazonians, read further. Just read and keep reading. I'm sharing this and you can see it clearly. You can see it clearly from what I share. This is clearly a scam. And if it sounds like a scam, it's a scam. They are scamming the people of Ambazonia. And so your eyes should be open. Listen, Ambazonians. There is so much division happening right now in the Ambazonian revolution that we have to start focusing on our own selves. Let me repeat. There is so much division these divisive diasporan Ambazonians that we have to start focusing on our own selves. I mean, heavily armed. Cameroon that is heavily armed is not even part of the so-called conference. Yet, Ambazonians are rushing, running behind Canada with empty hands. Heavily armed is not even part of the Canadian conference. Talk less of the Swiss conference that has been rolling for more than two months, for two years. Cameroon was not even part of it because Cameroon is not blinking. But we Ambazonians, we are the ones blinking. Each time they wave at us, we blink. Each time they wave, we blink. Stupid. Completely stupid. What are we afraid of? Are we afraid because Facebook labeled us terrorists? Who is Facebook? Facebook is a non-state actor. Irrelevant to the point where it even changes its name to Meta. Facebook, some digital platform, some what I don't know how to substantiate it. Calling you a terrorist and you're panicking. Maybe that's why you're rushing to Canada to prove a point that terrorists do negotiate. No, no. A non-state actor calling another non-state actor a terrorist group and you're panicking. This is ludicrous. I expect the egg of C to tender an apology for the people of Ambazonia. It is a wrong move. It is completely a wrong move. If, for example, Sako was part of that Canadian conference, everyone would say, oh, Sako don't think money, Sako not sit man, Sako not this. Now is the egg of C. What should we say? Should I come and say, oh, no, it's a good thing? No, when it doesn't sound right in Tapang's ear, it is not right. If it doesn't sound right in my ear, it is not do not play politics. La Republic to Cameroon has been searching for General No Pity to slaughter. That's why they went after General Cross and Die. At the time they were killing General Cross and Die, we were sitting in Canada to die <laughs> for the in Cameroon. That is exactly the stupidity of some of us Ambazonians. At a time we were sitting, tailoring our ambitions, our hopes in Canada to facilitate the end to the war according to the Coalition for Dialogue and Negotiation, 
at the time we were doing this just yesterday in Canada, that was not present was busy killing General Cross and die. Tell me who is more strategic. Isn't La Republic du Cameroon more strategic than the people of Ambazonia? More strategic than our mindsets? This is La Republic du Cameroon rolling out to set up a coalition for dialogue to articulate their own goals, ending the war in Cameroon. And flagging it in front of in front of us, and we are confused. We are rushing towards that to think that maybe something useful is going to come up from it. Now, give me an example. Let me just ask you this question: Do you think this so-called Canadian dialogue for whatever, Canadian dialogue for something or coalition for dialogue? Do you think it can give you independence? How will it give you independence? What powers do they have? Who knows them? Who some white street urchins in America and Canada? Some street urchins. It's stupid. It's completely stupid. Grow up. The mentality of the African man today should not be the mentality of the African man 50 years ago. Uh, the fact that I speak against the egg of C's wrong move, premature ejaculation when the game is still going on. This is completely a premature ejaculation when the match has not started. The fact that I speak against this premature ejaculation in Canada, for now we are not yet at power parity with La Republic du Cameroon. How does La Republic du Cameroon function in, Cameroon, in Ambazonia? They roll out their cars, they roll out their hillocks, machine guns, they walk motorized, but we walk on foot. We are not yet at power parity. We are not yet at power parity. We are not yet at power parity, yet we are rushing for their so-called dialogue. We have to focus on building our internal selves first. Why should you go and be fooling yourself in Canada, whereas there are more important things to focus on? That's how dull some of you are. Now you don't even think out of the box. According to you, people who come and criticize the U.S. government, they don't like America. People who come and criticize Joe Biden's democracy, they don't like Joe Biden. They don't like America. So, so stupid, a short-sighted intellectual mindset. It one key reason why the Canadian conference is good. Someone should drop it down. Drop it down here. Or I can open my lines and someone calls me. I need one key reason why the Canadian conference is a good thing. Just wasting people's resources, traveling there. And you were accusing Sako two months or three months ago or one year ago. Oh, Switzerland this, Abdul Karim, Switzerland this. I mean, like, does it even sound right in the ear? Does it even make any sense in your ears? Give me one reason. I'm, I'm waiting for someone to challenge me. Just give me a reason why the Canadian Conference is a good, reason. It's a good thing. One, just one reason.